Okay, welcome to my Amiibo box video. With number real? I don't know. I got some Amiibo on the box. I got some Amiibo right here. That's one in the box. Hmm. I repeated that because I feel like I said that big quiet. Here we go. Let's start with the oldest Amiibo I've been seeing around here. Far from almost a month and a half. Orms, I know. That's the deal on box video. It's the Orms from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I don't have the Orm scenes for Switch. Min Min! Min Min, you can tell I got the GameStop, beat the GameStop sticker new anyway. Only GameStop puts on there. Most time I get from GameStop or Target, that's it. I think Best Buy sell Amiibo too, but that's all the way down, that's all the way down. That's a lot of driving, it's like burning up a lot of gas. What I'm trying to say is I don't look close by Best Buy. Well, I only look close by GameStop anyway. Within walking distance. Anyway, there's this chair back here. And I'm just turn it back. You don't ever see some Mebo having this open here thing? This, this open here thing? Open man, man. Turn out the back right here. Pop, slide in. Pop, slide in. Casing it. Min Min. Next we can do. Next we can do. Belthar. Belthar. I forgot his name. I know it's just Smash for Belthar. Fire Emblem character, obviously. I mean, it's Pizza back. Nothing raised really there, but I was just showing you. And let's see here. Should I use a knife? I think my finger will suffice. Ouch. I broke my finger now. Okay. I was gonna use I was using freaking to open it up anyway. Not to just throw this stuff on the floor. On the floor. <sighs> What's an Amiibo? Something that has NFC chips inside of a near perfect compatibility. The most infamous sample when somebody uses Sadness Amiibo to open up a security door at an airport. Oh, there you go. Cool plastic detail. There you go. I'm gonna set you over right next to me, man. Okay. The next one. The next one, I think I do. Yeah, there's a lot. 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 Oh boy. I know I didn't bother to show you his case, but I didn't really bother to show you his case. Check the Japanese packaging. What? No, there's no Japanese packaging. Oh well. I don't know what I'm talking about. One of these does. Uh, it's a Monster Hunter Rising Amiibo in the back of the box. I think you've already seen that, but. Ruff, ruff. I think I got two of these by accident. Here's the other one. I think it's Primer Mute. Monster on the Rising. I already opened it up, but I already opened it up. I got two of these by accident. I just saw it. I went shopping. I saw it. Look, ooh, I don't have that amiibo. Then I came back like, oops, bought it twice. Bought it twice. I'm pretty sure they don't have any use in Smash Bros. Ultimate, but Monster on the Rising got to be the Pacific Nintendo version. I can't see that. PC version or PlayStation version or Xbox version. It's gotta be the Nintendo version. Come on, we all know that. Put the package Not much to show off. Not much to show off. Not much to show off. There's no defect between both of them. They're just doing the same amiibo. Wolf Tales. And here's another Monster Hunter. It's another Monster Hunter. Rise. Monster Hunter Rise Amiibo. Let's see here. You can't read it because the GameStop sticker right in the way. I think it's Sunbreaker. I think it's Sunbreaker. Well, I'm gonna Sunbreak it out the package. Look at that. I don't think it's this. I think it's this. Not really. 
I just buy Amiibo whenever I see them. I don't use AmiiboTracker.com. I don't care to go to AmiiboTracker.com. A website tells you the most rare Amiibo. I really want to know that. Yeah, if I'm that big of a nerd, I don't care. It's too nerdy for me. And when I heard about that in 2014, I said no. Uh, well, another dog. We're not a dog. Monster Hunter. Monster Hunter hunting dog. Yay. I think it's Sunbreaker. And the last time on Amiibos. That's my Amiibo. Steve and Alex. Steve and Alex. Yeah, Alex. Let's see here. This says I'm awesome. That's a two pack. I know what this. It's three pack. Oh, I miss Toys R Us and all their unsold Amiibo. Ugh. Mm, just twist and pull. Twist and pull should come out of there. Here you go. Steven Alex. I don't think I'm not carefully anyway. Why did they make Steven Alex an Evo? For Super Smash Brothers. For Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Super Smash Bros. right in the corner. You put that down. I thought they made them. They might have used in Minecraft. They might have used in Minecraft as a Switch version. I don't know. Alex and Steve. Alex and Steve. There you go. Yep, they have the owner's copyright bottom of that. That's all the Amiibo I have. That's all the Amiibo I have. There is one more thing Amiibo related I have. I got some Animal Crossing Amiibo cards. They're on pack number five. Pack number five. I don't know. I think I might have bent the case. Or it might have been bent like that. A little bit, but it doesn't matter. I'm not going to unbox them all. I just wanted to show you. Yeah, I buy the NFC cards. Not as much, not as, much as I used to, but... I'm not really going for a complete set anyway. I'm not going for a complete set, but I can't really find myself going on the internet or them online. That's what I'm trying to say. And the last is a new DC Universe animated movie. Yay! It's Batman, the uh, Batman Super Sons. Yay! Laser vision to a laser vision pro crap. I don't know, Scott, we used to make fun of. God used to make fun of me for buying all this stuff. Oh, the back of the, this is the back of the case. This is the back, same thing back there. Anyway, buying all the movies. I don't care. I don't care. It's just something to watch. Kind of wish DC was doing the same thing. These movies are particularly, from what I understand, straight to home video. So if you don't know them, don't know them, you're in, you don't understand what this is. They're just straight to home video. That means it's too bad they don't show them in theaters. Curse you, 80s, in your VHS, in your, in your, the 80s created this. Straight to home video market with VHS, with VHS, Blue, VHS, Laser Disc, and Betamax. They carry just straight to home video market where movies are just made to go straight to home. Typically, those movies don't sell as well. They go in theaters. This is direct to home video market. There you go. They got the plastic slip. And I'm pretty sure it comes with digital copy code. Oh man. When it comes to these digital when it comes to these digital codes, when it comes to these digital hooks right here. I never really use these digital codes anyway. I always give them away to my brother. I never I just don't feel like signing up just to redeem it digitally. And now for the real price, you real and now for the real I mean maybe once I might get into a swing, but you would think oftentimes sometimes I'm not sure if they even let you download it. Straight to the Blu-ray itself. That's it. There's really not that's it. That's the Blu-ray itself. That's the actual movie itself. There's nothing. There's no art behind there. There's nothing. Mm, there's no... Yep, there's no... In-game art. That's it. That's the movie. This, this movie, I just bought it while I was just shopping at Target. Probably watch it. Probably watch it. I think it's rated PG-13. Mm, we, no, this direct to home video. Released on video by Warner Brothers on this side. That's it. It just has violence and language. So it's not a kid's film. Anyway. Oh, well, thank you for watching this amiibo. Watching this unboxing video. And here is all the amiibo. Here's all the amiibo. Here's all the amiibo unboxed. Can't fit them all in my hand. Can't fit them all in my hand. Anyway. 
Steve, Alex, that one, that one. Nope. Yeah, that's all the Mimo unbox. I like thank you for watching the video and putting it down. And that's pretty much it. This like thank you for watching the video. Where you play Smash Brothers with or without with or without NFC NFC amiibo figures. That's it. I'm gonna end the video here. Until next video. Goodbye. Bye for now.